Hello everyone, today I'm going to be filming a Zara haul. This is the November 2019 Zara haul and it looks like I got a lot of things. from the thumbnail I know because I had two things that I um, collected from the store and then I went in store and I bought like just literally two or three things so it's going to be quite a short haul it is going to be a try on haul hopefully but depending on how much space I can find around me and mo more than likely you probably won't see my face in a try on haul but anyway I digress the first thing and the most important thing in this whole haul that I initially went to Zara to get was a new winter coat. I have had a green like Parker style Zara coat for years, literally since I was in sixth form, it's been a long time and whilst that is a lovely coat I do feel like I've outgrown it now Um, I don't feel like it fits the best and I don't love the style anymore plus I have worn it so well like if I could like say cost per use it'd be down to like less than one penny per use because that's how many times I used it and wore it and because our things tend to last they tend to have really really good quality pieces for that reason I was in the need for another coat now obviously I've got a lot of jackets and I've got um, a lot of denim and short jackets and I've got longer jackets but I needed something that was slightly warm but still had room for me to be able to layer up underneath and when I went in store I could only see really 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 thick pieces and I that's not what I was looking for even though I am living in Scotland and it's pretty cold here already I didn't want anything that was super super thick yet one day I will have a really gorgeous like furry coat but right now this is not the time for that so I went online then after I'd been in store and not had any luck and I found this coat this is literally like I think it's called like their like basic coat and <laughs> this is in the size medium and it is 30 pounds which I'm so happy with like it's such a bargain price for Zara that's something I'd expect to pay in I don't know Primark even for a nice winter coat and this is what it looks like now I don't know why okay it's not looking too bad it was throwing off my camera massively before but this is the color of it it's a beautiful camel coat it's got like um a sort of wool feel to it and it's got a really 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 nice length for me so the next thing I ordered for collection from Zara was a pair of their culottes and these were on sale for £13 on the label it says it's £26 they were £13 for a pair which I was really really happy with um, I have had a pair of their culottes before and I've just worn them so much that the hem underneath like that came undone and it was looking a bit messy this seems to be a bit of a different fabric but still the same style we've still got the bow here it's a bit of a thicker fabric for some reason which I'm not complaining about but yeah I got this in a size medium again and what can I say I mean a pair of black cloths will go with every, anything and everything it will just dress an outfit up or you can wear them casually the amount of times I've worn cloths with trainers I cannot count they just add a sort of smart edgy feel to a more street look and then they can also be dressed up with a nice pair of heels and a pretty top or blouse or shirt and a blazer so this is like a staple in everyone's wardrobe I feel like and I just again buying from Zara is just for me it's like a, one of those pieces that I just feel like it is gonna last me a long time and I'm gonna get the best cost per use so yeah that's the second item and then moving into the things that I got in store so the first thing that I picked up was this cropped sweater and this was 16 pounds and I got this in a size small um, and it looks like this so it's like a cross between a khaki and a brown beige color and I like the fact that it looks like sort of like a sweatshirt so it's not too thick but it will sure add some warmth and I also really like the neck I mean the only thing with this neckline is that I I mean no you could wear necklaces with this actually you guys can tell I've been really into my accessories lately hence this 
different hijab style, which is something you're concerned about, nothing to be worried about. I do wear my hijab the other way as well, but I do like to wear it like this sometimes so I can enjoy an accessory or two. And this piece of clothing, I would definitely, definitely wear it with one of my like long tops that sort of go between my knee and my hip and then I just put this on top so this is like a layering piece I like the color of it I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe and I just like the neck I feel like it's gonna be really cozy and a good piece to wear for autumn winter time the next top slash jumper that I got is again 16 pounds I got it in a size small again and it is this so it's gonna throw my camera off a bit. I'll just show you guys. It's got like a sort of sweatshirt material, but it is a bit more on the fancy side for a sweater. It's got these like half balloon sleeves, like so. And um, I thought that this would be really, really nice by itself, like just to wear by itself alone with, again, like this pair of black clots or even a pair of jeans as well. I don't know, something about this really took to my fancy. Now, if I try it on and I don't like the way it looks or I don't like the cut of it or I feel like it's too figure hugging, then you probably won't be seeing this on screen and I will be returning it. And the final item that I got from Zara is something that I've had my eye on for a while and just treat myself to it. And it is this orange jumper. I've seen this in store at least four times and I've walked past it and I've picked it up and held onto it and thought, mm, do I want it? Do I need it? Do I like, am I really going to wear it? And then I just bit the bullet and I got it. On the screen, it's coming up a little bit more vibrant than it is in real life. It's, it's more of a sort of pumpkin shade. And what I really love about this are the sleeves. Obviously, they're not tied right now, but you can tie them into a bow. And I just think that the sleeves and the neck detailing here, got a bit of a roll neck over here. They just make this a perfect winter jumper. And I can guarantee that you guys will see me wearing this a lot on my channel. I'll be wearing this a lot in real life as well. Um, it's such a lovely thick material and I, I can tell it's going to be something that's going to keep you nice and warm and this was £30 so it wasn't cheap but again because it's from Zara I expect this will last me for many a winter to come and I just love the colour. And I was thinking about like the wardrobe, like behind me basically you can see the wardrobe that I've got at the moment and um, we are kind of doing the whole capsule wardrobe thing but not, not on purpose, like this is a set we've got going on right now and it's really helpful actually because you can properly see what you own, what you've got and, and really wear your clothes well. And I don't have anything like this and I have felt like I've been lacking some warmer pieces in my wardrobe. So especially now that winter's coming up and it is getting really cold when you go outside, just thought this was so lovely. And again, this would look so good with the clots. It would look great with um, a pair of blue jeans or even black jeans as well. And even with my skirt that I got from Zara last year, I think this would look really nice on top. So I absolutely adore this and I'm so glad I bit the bullet and got it, even though it was a little bit more pricey than I typically would pay for in Zara, but it's a piece that hopefully should last me a while. And then the last item that I got, and this is like not gonna look new because it's not, this is what I got in the summertime, but I haven't showed you guys it yet, it is actually a very large Zara canvas bag. Um, this is exactly the same bag that you can carry around with you in store and put your bits and bobs in before you get to the teal but you can also buy it if you just go to a sales assistant and ask them they'll get you a, bra a brand new one from the back and I love taking this with me whenever I go shopping because it fits absolutely everything that you could need. I'm somebody who likes to carry around everything including the kitchen sink <laughs> so this bag has been really handy in the summertime and even now like if I'm just popping to the shops I'll put this inside my handbag and then well, as soon as I start buying things this bag comes out and it carries everything comfortably. I don't have to worry about bags ripping because now there's a lot of paper bags and stuff. This was actually, I didn't even know you could buy these until I watched Amima's video. So Amima, if you're watching this, thank you so much for sharing that. And with that being said, I am going to end this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have been buying bits and bobs from Zara recently, let me know down below what you've been picking up. What do you recommend? Do you like their current collection? Do you think it was better? It's been better before? Let me know what you think. And I will see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.